So family, waiting on the sun to come up. Figured I'd show what I was working on. Little Hot Wheels customs. Been slowly progressing on each one. Here and there, whenever I can work on them. Got this little guy. It's one of them that had a broken drill bit. I was able to drill it out a little deeper and tap the threads into it. So that worked out. Started off like this. Had no detail on the front or back. Had a light blue interior. Gave it a beige tan interior. Had a detail on the front. Black wash in the grill. And just straight black paint. Headlights, tail lights, license plate. Let me see if I can get some decals for that, some water slides. I will cut my nails today. I always cut them outside. It's one of my pet peeves. I hate it when people cut their nails in the house and they fly everywhere. That's disgusting to me. Cut nails in the floor. Anyways, it's not what I'm here to talk about. Had too many of y'all burn on them in the past. The bumpers done in the liquid pen. I was able to squeeze some out of the old pen I had, but I did have a new one show up yesterday. I did the trim around the front and rear windows. Did a black wash in the crevice before I did the chrome. Try to give it some depth. And I polished the decals off the side. Try to make it look a little more like a realistic car. Did the wheel swap on this one. Totally changed the look of that one for sure. I did the bumpers. I guess I mentioned that. Still needs blue paint on the black down here. I'll probably match that up later. Still got to put the clear coat on this one. Mentioned it on the last video, and I was not able to drill that one out deeper. It has the other broken drill bit in it, so that was a shame. Anyways, tried to send a friend a picture of this, but it wouldn't go through. I guess my phone being out of data won't let me send pics through Texas right now. That was a nice little difference anyways. A pretty simple upgrade. Didn't take a complete repaint or anything. Did black down in the crevice around the door. Oh, there he is. Started real easy on these with the wheel swap and then a wheel swap in the interior paint in both of these. We'll take this one back apart and do the chrome around the windshield. Uh, bumpers. Washing the grill, headlights. And when that sun comes up, I'll go do a video on the Impala. Got a few more things done on it. Got another car sitting out in the driveway I can show. I've been putting it off because I don't know how far he's going. It's supposed to go all the way. Already done a lot of parts to it. Just put a vinyl top on it. It's a 72 Cutlass. And 
and I just got my internet upgraded to fiber optics so I'm gonna get in here and see how long this video takes to upload supposedly it should be very quick so I wanna see oh, I got one other thing I can talk about before I cut off here power of the primes Dinobots about three years ago I wanted to pick up one of these upgrade kits and I put it off, put it off, put it off and couldn't find them anymore and about seven months ago I just decided to look it up on eBay and there was one of them for $999 I said nope I'll never get that it's originally 65 bucks so I thought to myself well this company's missing out on selling these still so they should reissue them and about three weeks later I seen it pop up on Big Bad Toy Store for pre-order for 65 bucks so I jumped on that <clears throat> took six months after that to get it it just showed up this week actually some nice parts for 65 dollars so anyway anxious to put that together it's a different version than the original comes with painted swords and it comes with plain black ones that's a nice touch I did get the version that has more of a gold paint and these figures don't quite match so I may end up customizing these in the future. Already cleared a spot for it. He'll go up here for now. But all this is probably coming down soon so I can make more room to work on upholstery stuff in here. That guy has an upgrade kit also. It's the only combiner I have an upgrade kit for. Be nice to find the other ones. Cleared that shelf off. It's coming out of here. There's a seat I did for the cutlass through the summer. This guy brought me the parts individually while the car was being worked on. And just recently brought the car by for me to put the top on it. But now he wants me to put the interior together. So we'll see. Alright, let me go upload this video. I haven't had any sleep yet. I can't sleep. I just made me a cup of coffee and wait for the sun to come up. Peace. Talk to you on the next one.